this is your conductivity probe. And what you'll notice is the actual sensor is encased inside that plastic um, protective sheath. You want to make sure that that sensor is completely covered by your liquid when you perform this lab. So let's get our liquid out. Probably making you seasick with my camera work here. All right. You want to make sure that that is completely covered there. One thing you'll notice is that when you get that completely covered, you may have to swirl it. And what you'll see is that we're dealing with a very, very sensitive scale here. We're dealing with micro siemens, right? A millionth of the unit. So the chances of getting it completely stable are going to be small. But what you'll notice is that you don't get those first couple numbers to change. If you see a little bit of variation in the last ones, that's fine, as long as you've got those first numbers nice and stable. And that's it. The actual techniques for this lab are pretty easy.